back to my channel so we're gonna be doing part two of my um, makeover as you can see behind me some things have changed which you'll see in the video so I will see you in part three soon and I hope you enjoy this one bye <sighs> new development I've managed to get the other wardrobe up but I don't know if I'm gonna you know you can screw them together because this floor is not completely level I don't know if I'm gonna do that because you can see it's got a gap this is the closest they can get I'm not about to drill through them so um, I'm probably just gonna let drill them to the back so it's secure and they'll just have to be if there's a little gap between the things so be it so at least they're up second rails in I've just got to put this little shelf and then I've got one drawer and I've got two more drawers that I need to order <laughs> I've kind of coordinated all these or tried to best as I can down there and I'm going to put everything back on the rails Okay, so next I'm going to do the drawer and the shelf. I've got the clothes in, but I'm going to do a revamp of my clothes. Slowly buying new clothes, so most of these will probably go. But yeah, I'm happy with it so far. I love how the wardrobe looks. Okay, so this is what the room's looking like now. I've done the drawer and I've changed around a few of the things here because I wasn't happy with how it was before, but I love how it is now. So I've just put the sign up there, a few of my bags. A teddy and then I've got some clothes folded there a few more bags in there and then I've swapped the two cupboards around or drawers or wardrobe should I say this one's got all the lighter stuff and then all the darker stuff and a few brights are in this one and then obviously the drawers up and I'm just waiting for two more drawers to come so this is why I've got a few things folding under there but yeah this is how it's looking at the moment so this is another new sheet I've had to buy. The one that I bought to originally go on the bed is um it was too big for some reason. I don't know, it must have been a super king size, even though it said a king, but it just looked ridiculous. So I've ended up having to buy another one. This is just a plain one for Margaret's because I just want a plain um bed in and then I'll just jazz it up with cushions. So this is the one I've ordered. Later. So guys, I've just bought some new pillows, this one, and then I bought some white ones which are in this bag. So I will be putting on my new bed in today, finally. Eventually. have finished the bed and I really love how it looks just quite simple I love the colors of the throw in the pillows this throw could have been a bit longer but I've just kind of worked with how it is yeah and I still haven't got the two drawers yet so it's a bit of a hot mess down there and I've just got to sort out this side got a few bits I've got the paint in here and some other bits I need to clear out so I love it let me know what you think. So I do have this other grey fro, which is a nice furry one. So I could, I can just swap and change that and maybe get some grey pillows and then swap that round one for a pink, pink one. Like with, this is what it looks like with the grey fro. So I've just folded it in half because this one's quite a big one. But I prefer it with the pink because this grey doesn't actually go with the cushion. So I'll just use that when I've got my grey bed in. Okay, so 
Oh, look at the room. New mirror and radio was painted white, and then the bedding. You can see now I'm having to use my iPad because my camera battery went out. And then the wardrobe's nearly done, just waiting for the two drawers. I'm just going to end it here, guys, and I will see you in my next video.